course, Anouk Jobert and a bit further down the order, Yulia Kaplina, the only two women who can win the overall titles. It's a good start from Anouk. Doesn't need to quite go at full speed to win this one. The cameraman's struggling to keep them both in the frame. This should be a relatively easy run for Anouk. It is. Team France is strong as ever this weekend. This could be tight. It's a good start from both women. Relatively even so far, but Motteville over opening up a bit of a lead. Less than a metre though. A slip could decide it. No, not quite. 9.16. An all Poland race. One of our stronger athletes will be out already at this early stage. Bookcheck on the left, Brozak on the right. Good start from Brozak, but Bookcheck quickly reined in the lead. And if anything, she's opening up one of her own. I think she's going to take this. She is. 8.40, 8.67 for Brozak. We will talk overall standings in the women's competition shortly. And it's a fast start from Ropek, but once again Saracen gained that gown quickly and I think he's going to hold on to this lead she's developed. If anything, it's growing towards the top. It is 8.64. So here's one of the women who could claim the overall title today. Yulia Kaplina, one of only two, her and Anouk Joubert. She's up against Nina Lack, if you watched. Both women twitch there. Kaplina first, then Nina Lack, but it was a clean start from both, and Kaplina's opening up a big lead. And we'll bring this home at 8.31. Strong French athlete. Ukraine always strong in speed climb. There's a slight twitch from Arenich early on, and it seems to disrupt her. Slip very low down on the third hold. Alma Fleury just needs to cruise home, she does. Alexandra Rudzinski currently sits third overall and was third a few days ago and Wu Jiang takes on Dean Yu of China and it's a good start from Niu and Rudzinski is going to have to work for this one she has opened up a small lead and she's just about hanging on to it and she gets a good start and if anything that lead's increasing should be a relatively straightforward one for Siganova Commentator's curse strikes again, sneaks under <laughs> 10 seconds. Anouk Jobert, Svetlana Motovilova. Takes on Svetlana Motovilova and she gets a good start. Anouk, about a metre lead so far and if anything that's growing. If she glances to the right, she'll see she's got a relatively easy run to the top. Put check on the left, Saracen on the right. Both of them twitching slightly at the start. And it's Saracen who is faster in the lower third, oh, but a slip at mid-height. These humid conditions cause a lot of slips. Yulia Kaplina here in with a shot of winning the overall World Cup champions today. And she's got a metre lead over Elma Fleury. I think she's going to hang on to it. She is 8.02 to 8.88. Best food of the year though, won't I? Absolutely. So Rudzinska on the left, World Championship winner, Tigan over on the right. And this is tight, oh. but it's not once yeah, Rudzinska slipped. Oh. 8.07, good time for Tigan over. Our four semi-finalists will be Anouk Jobert, Claudia Bukcek, Yulia Kaplina and Anna Siganova. Jobert on the left. Is oh, just stumbling. Can't, can't seem to find a rhythm, Anouk Jobert, but I think even then might do enough. No, 9.30. World Championship winner from a month ago in her way, though. Anna Siganova, she's on the right, Kaplina's on the left. And it's a fast start from Siganova. I thought close to the limit of the start, but it... Kaplina's sheer speed sees her through. She takes it in 7.84, fast time, 9.59 from Sigurd Nova. So Yulia Kaplina progresses to the big final. So Anouk Jobert on the left, she's taking on Anna Sigurd Nova. And it's a good start from Anouk, but also from Sigurd Nova. Four time World Cup winner on the left, world champion on the right. Four-time World Cup winner who gets it in 8.02. No. And Anna's uh, got the bronze medal. So I do think that means Yulia's won the overall season. She has won the overall season. Yulia just set herself there. Almost looked like a little twitch as well. And it seems to have thrown her slightly off her rhythm. It has. I think Bukchuk's going to take this. She is 8.65, 9.66 for Kaplina. So second place for Kaplina. What a great end to the season for her.